Okay. Huh. Welcome back to another episode of Whiskey and Wine 101. I'm Marvin. And I am Bong. And it's March, and we actually haven't shot a video together since December? Yeah, it's got to be more than six months. Or of three months, for no. sure. Yeah. Not so, three months. this is the first nope. uh, video that we've done together for 2022. Yes. All right, so... In a couple of days, it will be St. Patrick's Day, so we figured we'll do some Irish whiskeys. Um, I've got a little bit of Jameson left over, so we're going to start there. Yep. As you can see, I'm also trying to rock a new setup, so we'll see yeah. if the audio is better, if it's cooler. Yep, you missed um, it. I was singing a while ago. It was. Yep. Be glad. Um, <laughs> so... First off, we're going to do Jameson Black Barrel. This is um, coming in at 40 proof. Okay. And then I've got a little bit of some Jameson Special Reserve 12 year. This has long been discontinued, um, but I've got a little bit left and it also is coming in at uh, 40 proof. The Black Barrel is non-age stated. It's just um, the regular Jameson that's then additionally aged, I think in used charred barrels or something like that. Okay. I'm not 100% sure. Um, Jameson, I believe it's the number one Irish whiskey. I don't have a regular bottle to crack open. I got the big ginormous bottle there right in the there. corner, but that's for display purposes only. We uh, are rocking some new yeah. hardware. This is the Wisdom Glass. Yes. I believe it's your first time using it. Yes. How do you think? What? How does it feel to you? Awesome. Heavy? Hefty? Yes. All right. For those so not sponsored, but check out Whiskey Wisdom for the Wisdom Glass. It is now shipping. Just came out in January. All right. There you go. So, Bong, let's do the Jameson Black Label. All right, and uh, we go ahead and uh, pour you some. Okay. All right. All right. So, Jameson, all Irish whiskeys, I believe, basically come out of the Middleton Distillery. Uh, Jameson started years ago because in Ireland they would each grocery store would make their own whiskey i believe and so yeah i believe that's where jameson comes from william and sons was the original distillery or founder or owner what do you think have you drank i don't i know uh, you've black? had some of this um no i tried i tried um i tried the um regular jameson the stout uh, oh the so they do have like an yep. IPA, the IPA stout. Yep. Um, so they're doing some additional finishes. Yep. Um, the other thing out of Jameson or out of Middleton is the Riders and Tears. Uh, correct me in the descriptions or in the comments below, but that's their um, more experimental. Yes. Cheers. Those All are right. the flavored uh, one, but. Yeah. So, what do you get? Straight vanilla? Yeah, sweet. Uh, <laughs> like a buttery biscuit? Yeah, like not too cookie. strong. Vanilla, caramel? Not too strong, though, on me. It's 40 proof, so it's not going to be yeah. too, too serious. All right. So that, that looks pretty good. Now, the nose is amazing. Yes. It, it smells good. It's 40 proof, so it's not going to... It's not going to knock your socks off. There's not going to be a lot of heat to it. I agree. Uh, as you can see from the bottle, I do enjoy um, drinking the oh. black barrel. <laughs> okay. I'm almost empty, so I've got to, and I will pick up another one. I think it's something that's enjoyable. There's a little bit of uh, mint on it. I don't know if you were... No. No? Bong was just eating some barbecue downstairs, so I don't know. But I don't I don't get mint. I this get... Is, what do you get? Just a sweet uh, thing on it, and then it's a little bit 
Is it, maybe it's a spice, but then again, it's it's not. It's, there is there is a little bit of spice on there. Yeah. It definitely is sweet. Doesn't cool your mouth though, like a mint. Like yeah, there's a cooling to it. Not yes. a lot of heat. Okay. It, it's got like um, a buttery cookie. It's it's savory. It's but it's sweet. It's not too hefty. It's forty proof, so it's not burning going down. Nope, not at all. But it's an enjoyable sipper. Yeah. And I believe it's about 35 USD, give or take. Um, but yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Let's, let's compare it. Oh. All right. So no gas. we are going to compare it to the Jameson 12-year. Again, this one I'm kind of babying because they don't release it anymore yeah thanks okay so Ooh. all irish whiskey i believe is triple distilled they're all pot still is this pot still mm. full body pot still character irish whiskey triple distilled yeah. So again, this is 12 year. And again, I think the regular Jameson is about six to nine years old, six years old. So I guess the other difference is that one's black barrel, and then this one's just yeah, this a, one's, a blend. This one's secondarily finished. So this is a regular blend, but then it's finished again. Oh. All right. All right. Go and crack her open. I'm just Which trying Which one to... is the clear one, though? Okay. Oh, okay. So Jameson is aged for a minimum of four years. All right. So I don't have any of the regular Jameson again to compare. Oh, but the notes are definitely different. Yes. This one's sweeter. You know? The, the response to service. I, I, I can, on the nose now, get why you say mint. It's like a spearmint. All right. This is the black... Yeah, well, this one, I smell the caramel. This is more of an astringent note to it. You can smell the alcohol more. It's not as are sweet. They the same, are they the same proof? Yeah, 80 proof. Okay. Or 40, yeah. Okay, I can see why you say mint. I get mint on the nose now, but I don't get it on the flavor. Hmm, interesting. There is a little bit on it. This, this is more alcohol forward as far as for the aroma. Yep. Not as sweet. Um, hmm. Yeah, again, for 80 proof or 40% alcohol, it's not going to be <clears throat> that kind of pop out. But So I'm curious, do you, do you guys like Jameson? I mean, it is very popular. Yeah, I would like to know. What do you think about it? Just put a comment below. Malty. The 12 year just gives me wow. more cere they cereal are, notes. Yeah, they're, they're, they're different, definitely. And then, not as sweet. The black barrel is sweeter. Yes. This is more cereally. More, 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 um, bear? more, more charcoaly. I mean, you, you probably are getting the wood notes. The wood it notes, is 12 yeah. years old. Yep. So this does to me have more heat, even yes. though it's the same proof. Um, you definitely get the wood notes. Um, yes. Oh, what does this say? Toasted wood, spice, and sherry. Hmm. I smell the sherry on maybe on the nose, mm. but so not on the taste though. Yeah, so for me, the Jameson 12 year, like I said, I've been babbling it. It is more, it's more savory. It's not as sweet. The nose is more alcohol forward, but I do think the age, or at least the the wood on the age, is there. But to me, it's a more malty experience. Yes. 
um, yeah, it's got bold um, taste on it than the other one. That means uh, what I'm trying to say is, uh, yes, you can get this mm. spice and yeah, got more flavor on it than the other one. The other one, when you drink it, it's like it's cooling your mouth. All right, so. For me, for an everyday sipper, I would stick with the black label, the black barrel. Um, special occasions, or when I don't want anything as sweet, and then the Jameson 12 year. Again, it's not out, but you might still be able to find it somewhere on someone's back shelf like mine. Um, the one thing that's pretty exciting that I don't know if it will come to the United States. There is a Jameson Black Barrel cask strength. Hmm. So I believe it's in that 110, 120 proof. European release only for now. I know some people do have it. Um, I think Bourbon Jeeper or somebody on Instagram has it. Maybe even Bourbon Santa. I'm not sure. Shout outs to you guys. Yeah. But uh, And if you know, just comment below. Yeah. Yeah. If you've tried the black barrel cask strength, I would definitely love to know if you feel that the heat, the extra the the extra proof on it hits. Um I know some Irish whiskeys in the US are in the like you can get in that eighty six range, but nothing in that higher proof. Um hmm. which one did you like? So I like the black black barrel easy sipper easy sipper um, but if you're looking for a taste or bold taste you go with this one yeah you know um, yeah. all right well that's it for the Jameson edition we're gonna move on to another one um, happy st. Patrick's Day happy st. Patrick's Day Slanza. may the luck be with you cheers Guys. keep it one of one and we are out keep it one of one Thanks for watching this latest video. Oh, Follow it's been a long time. Instagram and YouTube <laughs> Whiskey and Wine 101. Okay. Hit that like button, subscribe, follow, and I will see you on the next one.